want to start us out in Longview atop the news journal uh, building and you can see right here cloudy skies in place, even a little bit of blowing snow right there and you can see the indications of the wind by that American flag waving in the background there. Beautiful flag by the way and it's still flying even if East Texas is entombed in ice. Temperatures right now are in the lower teens, 10 in Sulphur Springs. It's 11 in Mount Vernon. It's 11 in Quitman. We are at 11 in Mineola. Everybody's actually warmed up into the lower teens now. So baby steps, but it's getting better. 10 at the Tyler Pounds Airport. We're at 13 in Jacksonville. Middle teens right now for Nacogdoches County, and we're at 23 right now in Hemphill. I mentioned the wind's blowing, and it definitely has an effect on our fuels like temperature or our wind chill, feeling like we are below zero. And again, these are life threatening temperatures. You do need to be very careful. Make sure you bundle up, cover everything, because body heat escapes, especially when it's windy on a day like today. And if you absolutely do have to go outside, cover exposed skin because hypo thermia and frostbite can occur very quickly. Now satellite and radar again, we are watching for those breaks in the clouds. No evidence of that yet as the snow continues to push off to the north and to the east and the parts of Arkansas and Tennessee. But once again, we are not out of the woods yet, even though storm system number one is starting to move out of the area. We're going to start future cast out at six o'clock tomorrow evening. Some snow along the Red River. The pink starts showing up on the map and you can see we could have a, a major freezing rain event unfolding by six o'clock Wednesday morning, and this continues to be the case through about midday on Wednesday. But this is all pink. That's the bad stuff. The freezing rain, the sleet. Nobody likes to see that in the area because that is a lot more treacherous and that can be dangerous to the power grid and also to those trees out there by six o'clock, though. This mess is out of here and we're dealing with the clouds as we go into your Thursday. Let me quickly show you the seven day forecast and again tomorrow uncomfortably cold. We are at three degrees. That is the only that is as cold as it gets here in East Texas. Just about 24 for your Tuesday wintry mix Wednesday into Thursday 30s Friday into the 40s Saturday 50s on Sunday and deep East Texas. We are following the same trend, but all eyes after today will be Wednesday and Thursday. Isaac. Thank you, Carson. Continuing